everybody, it's Lisa Twilo's mom, and today is Sunday, January 21st, yes, and I have some friend mail to share with everyone, so let's go ahead and get started, okay? Now, I've already opened some of it, and the first one I have here is from Melanie. Hi, Miss Melanie. Hi, I hope you're having a great day. This one is just a little thank you card because I'd sent her, um, her and her grandma a little bit of Christmas blessings and they just wrote me a nice note saying thank you. And look at this card. Isn't that so cute? <laughs> I love that card. Thank you, Melanie, and thank you, Sally. I really, really love it. Thank you so much. And then the next one I got was from Lynette. Her channel name is Cheaply Chic, and I'm sure most of you who are uh, friends here on my channel, you're friends on her channel as well. And it's just a lovely card that says, just thinking of you. And she just wrote me a little thank you note also. And inside, she put these really cool journaling cards. Well, look at that. And I love this one. Isn't that cute? <laughs> There's me with my glasses. <laughs> and then I got another one from the Dazzling Duchess. Look at that. That little Yorkie dog. <laughs> and this card is really cool. It's the airmail card. And she was just giving me a little thank you note also, which none of you ladies needed to send me a thank you note. I sent you things because I wanted to. And, you know, at Christmas, you know. <laughs> and speaking of thank you notes, I have a whole stack here that are addressed and stamped and just waiting to go out. See, here's my stamps. Yeah. And do you think I mailed them today? No. It's It was, well, I mean, yesterday. It was Saturday. I um, got busy cleaning my kitchen, and my husband was outside, and he comes walking in with the mail. And I'm like, what? The mailman's already here. And he goes, well, Lisa, it's 1 o'clock. And I'm like, ugh. My mailman comes between 10 and 11. Mm -hmm. So, everybody, I'm going to be putting those in the mail Monday morning when I get off work, okay? <laughs> the next package I got is from a new YouTuber, and his name is David. Look at the washi that he put on there. That is so cute. I have that washi, too. It's got a little bird here. Now, I can't show you the front because it does have his real address. But the washi went all the way around the top. And he mailed this little package with only three stamps. And the three stamps didn't even get canceled. I don't get that. <laughs> Maybe I can show you real quick. See? They didn't even get... Isn't that weird? I thought they always got, like postmarked. See? They didn't get postmarked. Hmm. Curious. I'm curious about that. But inside of here, and I already opened it. I'm sorry. I just could not resist. I had to open it. He sent me this card where he wrote happiness. Well, he put stickers there across that say happiness and fun on the back. But this card... He stamped this peacock. If I had tried to do this, it would have been a mess. Me and stamps, oh, I'll, I'll take them out every so often and I'll practice with them and I'll play with them and stuff. But when I try to do something nice like this, it just gets crazy. Yeah. Very good work, David. That's a good stamp job. <laughs> But he had sent me um, a little note here and everything. And yes, I am feeling better. Thank you. 
And then he mentioned that Twilight made, or Twyla's name made him think of Twilight. Yes, her brothers uh, every so often will call her Twilight. It's not something she is happy about, but she's not upset. You know, she's just like, what? <laughs> but they all call her Twilight every so often, too. And a couple of kids at school do, too. So, yeah, you're not the only one that uh, her name reminds you of Twilight. <laughs> but inside of that envelope, he made me a pocket letter and it is so cute look at this it's all coffee themed look at the lots of different coffee pots at that one in that pocket and then this one down here I love this one I don't know where he got the picture of this guy but it just reminds me of something so vintage you know like from the 50s or the 60s that is so cool and he added the little jewels up on her steam. Did you color it too? I don't know. I don't think he colored it. But look what he did with the to-go cup. He spelled my name. <laughs> and then the tag that he added is a coffee cup. And then on the back, coffee makes everything better. And yes, it does. Yes, it does. <laughs> And then these coffee cups, and this one has a feather sticker that says lovely, and this one says wonderful. Aren't those so cool? Where did you get these? Did you copy them? Or you've got to let me know down below, David, where you got the picture of these coffee cups, because these are so neat. And like this, they're in the shape of a heart, if you didn't notice. I love that. I love that. Thank you. But he put little presents in the pockets and stuff. So, the first thing that he sent are these little keychains. And this one spells out my name. That is so cool. And it's got a little butterfly charm on it. Oh, I love that. I love that. This is going to hang on my bulletin board because I treat my car keys badly. I, do. <laughs> I just throw those things all over the place. <laughs> so I'm going to hang this on my bulletin board. Yes, I am. I love that. Thank you so much, David. But then he made one for Twyla and he put feathers on the end of hers. Isn't that neat? She's going to love this because her signature, oh, what would you call it? You know how I like sugar skulls and <coughs> coffee pots and coffee cups, you know, and I have a sugar skull magnet on my car door and things like that. She loves quills. You know, the old, um, pins that people would write with that have a feather. They used a feather and uh, she even has a t-shirt with her name across it with a quill with a feather. So she is going to love that. I don't know how you knew she would like this, but yeah, she's going to love that. Oh, that's so neat. She may put this on, on her key ring. She doesn't treat her keys like I do. <laughs> and then he sent a little package of these. Now, I haven't opened the package yet. I'm trying to be a little bit quiet because it's very, very late or early in the morning and everyone's asleep. So, oh, look. Look at these little women. Oh, my gosh. If you don't mind, David, I'm going to share these with Twyla because she really, really loves like this anime type, anime type um, girls. And she's always drawing this type of stuff. Oh, this is so cool. Where did you find these? Look at that girl. Oh, 
Oh, this one. I know Twyla will love this one. Look at that. It's got the owl on as a headdress. Oh, wow. Where did you get these from? And these are stickers. I love these. Oh, my gosh. Oh, look at this little girl. Oh, look at her. Oh, and this one. Oh, yeah. This one, though, she's so elegant. Where did you find these at? Oh, wow. Yeah, they're stickers. These are so neat. Thank you for sharing these with me. I might see if Twyla wants a couple of them because she really, really, she has her anime club at school, which she started. And, um, you know, they go to the Comic Con and things like that that we have in Kansas City and stuff. So she she's going to get a kick out of these. And then he made these paper clips for me, which are going to be so nice in my planner. I thought I had, yeah, there it is. It's the little, I never thought to do this. They are the um, little cloth flowers, and he put them on the, the paper clips. Oh, I never thought to do this. This is cool. And David's favorite color is yellow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that is really neat. And then he also sent me, which I'm not going to take these out of the bag because I don't want to drop any, a little baggie full of yellow um, gemstone flowers. You can do so many things with these types of stuff. Yeah, these are so neat. I love these. But then... Also in the pockets, he put these little envelopes. And I didn't open these. I waited. I waited. Okay. So we are going to, let me get my, there it is. We're going to go ahead and open these now. Okay. I'm trying to be careful. And he just made these little envelopes to put little things in. Oh, isn't that pretty? I like that. Oh, that's cute. Oh, look at that. Kind of goes with the color I'm wearing, which I'm just in a t-shirt. <laughs> oh, thank you, David. Oh, wow. That is so nice. Did you make this? I can't tell if you made this or not. You'll have to let me know. That is neat. I like it. And then we have the little pink one. Let's see what we got here. Oh. Now, in his letter, let me see. Okay, this is, oh, this is just as cool. This is neat. Look at this little bracelet. Oops, I got it. It's getting turned. <gasps> Isn't that cool? Huh? That is so neat. And then this one right here. Oh, now 
this one he had um, <coughs> he had sent for Twilight. He thought she might like it because her name reminds him of Twilight. And I'm not going to take it out of the little bag, but it's a little necklace with a stone that is in the shape of a star. Let's see. Let's see if I can. Isn't that pretty? Oh, she will love this, David. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. If she wasn't asleep, I'd give it to her right now. Oh, wow. Hmm. David, this was so nice, and it was so close to Christmas. You didn't have to do this, but I love that you did. I love the pocket letter, and I love the card, and wow. <laughs> <coughs> David, like I said, is a new YouTuber, and you guys really need to go and check out his channel. He did a little tour a few videos back where he showed um, some of his dollhouse miniatures, and that dollhouse was decked out. It was, yeah, I told him, I said, you need to do a video on your dollhouse miniatures. You will get a whole different genre of people watching you as much as you have and you know as well as your Dollar Tree hauls and your crafting hauls and stuff I said you will get them watching your channel as well because this dollhouse was it was magnificent I mean yeah I've never been one to I mean I like dollhouses they, they're neat and stuff but I've never been one to do one myself but his dollhouse almost made me want to do it. And Anna from um, Only In My Dreams, she does dollhouses too. So David, maybe you should connect with her also because you two have a lot in common. Because she will make like a seasonal type dollhouse each year. Like she has a small one room like dollhouse thing that she'll make a Halloween theme with it. And then the next... Then she'll do a Christmas with it. And she really, really does well with her dollhouse miniatures also. So, anyway, guys, I'm going to get off of here. Thank you so much for the lovely thank you cards. Thank you, Melanie. Thank you, Lynette. And thank you, Jeannie. Dazzling Duchess. <laughs> and thank you, David, for this great pocket letter. I love it. I don't think anyone has sent me a coffee-themed one. I don't. I'd have to look in my book. I have a um, notebook that I keep them in, so I would have to look. But this is cool. I like that vintage one. That's so cute. Don't this remind you of Mrs. Potts on Beauty and the Beast? A little bit. Her smile and her eyes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, everybody. I'm going to get off of here now. Please, don't leave me a comment. Leave me a comment for the um, lovely people who have sent me a card and a pocket letter. And don't forget to go and check out Lynette's channel. If you aren't already subscribed, her channel is Cheaply Chic. And the Dazzling Duchess, Jeannie Louise, her channel name is the Dazzling Duchess. And David, and he has a new channel and he just goes by David V. <laughs> And Melanie and Sally, they don't have a channel, but they are just, I just love hearing from Melanie and Sally. So everybody, don't forget to leave that comment below for everybody that sent something. So I'll talk to you guys later. I'm getting a little bit dry, <clears throat> if you can't tell. Yeah, got to get me some warm tea on my throat. <clears> throat> okay. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.